The first batch of foreign workers linked to Philippine offshore gaming operator or Pogo who were rescued from human trafficking activities in October were repatriated to Vietnam Tuesday morning. This initial group consists of 22 males and 5 females, all hailing from Vietnam. The rescue operation took place on October 31st when the Aviation Security Group of the Philippine National Police intervened at Naia Terminal. Two. Ibig sabihin, kaya natin sila pinauwi kasi napatunayan na sila mga biktima ng human trafficking. At nagvoluntaryo naman sila na gusto nilang umuwi. Originally, 34 po sila. Kaya lang, kanina madaling araw, 27 pa lang ang nakauwi na Vietnamese. Kasi yung tatlong Chinese, wala pa silang travel document. Inaantay pa ang proseso ng kanilang embassy. Tapos yung apat naman na Vietnamese, uh, gagamitin nating witnesses. The authorities took action after a Vietnamese individual raised concerns, prompting an investigation. Upon further inquiry, it was revealed that the victims were foreign nationals employed at a pogo hub in Paranaque City. There were indications that they were being coerced into transferring to Cebu against their will. Kumbaga, ayaw nilang magpalipat sa Cebu. Yan po kasi ay isang form ng labor trafficking yan, yung pagpapalipat-lipat ng empleyado na hindi naman naayon doon sa kontrata. Pag ganyan po kasi, human trafficking victims, ang pulisiya ng gobyerno natin ay pauwiin yan sa kanilang bansang pinanggalingan. Kasi doon po mas makakaganda ang kanilang recovery na tinatawag. Kasi whether we like it or not, yung ganyan mga sitwasyon, may mga pinagdadaanan po yan na, na trauma. No? So, pinauwi talaga natin ang mga yan. Hindi sila maaari mag-stay dito sa Pilipinas. Thank you